Everyone, Neo Bliss is back once again. As you already know from my last video, my deck got didn't re editing properly, or I may have just forgot to turn the shell. The fact what do happen, you girl. Show me damn cards up to try to keep track, track of damn card fed by heart. But I have made some changes and see how it do this time. So I can show you the wonders of my beautiful deck. If we can get in this do, you already know got this my special guest back once again, man. E. And say something, my boy. What's going on? What's going on, people? I'm using a brand new deck. My deck is called the Half Deck. People ain't gonna know what it is. It's something that I came up with my own strategy ideas. So, with that being said, we're gonna duel. And I pick to go first to the point to it. So, let's duel. I pick to go first as well. Let's go! Oh! 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 Huh. This is a hand right here. Hmm. Interesting hand. Okay, let's see how this let's see how this gonna go. Oh, we got nothing. Oh. Alright. Alright. I'm liking this outcome. Guys, I'm very hyped. My my opponent didn't have anything in his hand to stop me. Okay, they usually do for me for some reason. Hey, they be hating my life in this game. I'm not gonna lie. I always, my, my guests can tell you, every time I'm playing this game, motherfucker got a map C or some kind of other fuckery up in there. Like, it's just on two. They be like, uh, it's this man again. Get a map C in his hand. We can fuck this man over. I'm like, damn. We on, we, we on this type of energy? what I do? Kind of deal here. But, since that's not the thing, get down to the graveyard, use the fetch. As you can see with the Mandanium, they are, they are not a once per turn. So I can keep popping them just to keep adding one for my deck onto the field if I wanted to. That's the beauty of this deck right here. I am a floodgate to its, to its max. Yeah, I say sometimes kind of deck. It like it's like I said, this is a trial deck. I got my other deck out there that's really good with the Mayanos in it already and stuff. So do not worry about it, guys. It's definitely, definitely really, really good. You guys definitely gonna like it too. I promise you that. And since I already exhausted most of the Mayanos in my deck, I'm just gonna get rid of everything. In one turn and see where we go from here, right? So don't mind me, guys. Let me work. Let me work the magic here. Hmm. Let's check something real quick before I just start doing crazy stuff. Oh, so that wouldn't work for you anyway. Cause you need a dragon. Okay, that's fine. Had to double check here. Had to double check before I go crazy. Well, I couldn't expect something. You know, like I said, so many stuff going on. And like I said before, these guys are not a once per turn. So you can see, no one just comes straight to the field like it was nothing. Easy peasy. First off, what I'm going to do, I'm going to link something. Get these two off the field real quick. You could be asking me, why am I link summoning, right? I just want to make room on the field for, you know, my monsters. And well, for the perks, I'm going to put you guys in defense mode. Just because, if they do, guys, you know, lightning storm, I don't got to worry about it. I can get other stuff that's more important at this moment. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Do I want to special summon you right now? I could. I could. But I doubt I would. Honestly, I could have did a better combo. But I still feel like there's technically no need for it. No, there's a need right now. Actually, let's do that. 
Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, let's go with it. Let's go with it. Let's go with it. Come out! My fusion! Nah, nah. I don't want to pop nothing right now. But I am going Link Summon. I am going Link Summon. Oh, shit. Synchro Summon! I have another negate on the field. Now it's time to our fusion summon. Summon you. I'm going to dump you. And I'm going to dump. Your effect boost all my monster in the field attack points by permanent 500 attack points. Activate your effect, pop my link summon monsters. You guys gonna see why later. Why I popped it, definitely gonna see why in a few. Why it's pop okay? It's gonna come together as a whole combo so I could outplay my opponent on his turn. This deck is made to play on my opponent's turn, to the best of my abilities. Now, every time a card leaves from the extra deck, I could pinpoint one monster in the field and negate it. Right? Hard out in the gate right here. Next turn come, I will turn her back. Special summon a monster that's level nine and lower. Nine ten, I'm going to get the fusion monster. Oh, go, go ahead. You got, you can keep that corner field. That's perfectly fine by me. But you gotta have a spellcaster for that fit to resolve. Nine ten, I'm just gonna rush right into you, honestly. Yeah. So right now, everything's in play. So next turn, if I use the negate, I can turn home back onto the field. That, that's it. He, that's all he going to do. Okay, guys. So let me show you why I sent um that monster to the graveyard right now. So her can special summon two monsters for my graveyard. One monster from one my graveyard, one monster from my opponent, two monsters from my opponent onto the field. One on my side and one on his side. So you can see the combination I'm about to do right now. I'm gonna give him my link monster. But don't think he's gonna stay there forever. Cause uh yeah, I'm offing that link monster right now as we speak. Unless he got a uh, card to negate. Which I think he does. I will hope he don't. Maybe got a mass C in his hand. I'm just gonna instantly negate it anyway with the floor, so it doesn't matter what he does. And here come Mirror J. And since a monster left my edge deck again, I could permanently boost all my monster effect, all my monster attack up again. Wow. They gave one card face on the field, monster on the field. Mind you, this is all still on his turn. This is what I could have did if he wouldn't try to go off for me.
That's crazy. You eat dog on it. That go do. Hard to get in that car. That was a good. That was a good play on his part. That was a excellent play. That right there was an excellent play. I ain't gonna lie. Well done. That definitely was a well done play. I like that play. No lie with that one. I like that play. Respect. All that respect for that play. You got rid of my Ice J Dragon. Was not expected to happen. Not at all. Should I return you right now? Yeah, I could return you. First, <laughs> let's activate that car first. Let's activate that car first. Hey, almost forgot about that. I'm about to do something crazy. Yeah, I'm not gonna hold you guys. I am sad. I did had to get rid of my um IJ monster, but it's perfectly fine. I want to do let's go activate add a card I'm adding star frost to my hand but first I participate Activate effect. You're going to see right now, guys. I'm about to go off on him. Bye-bye. his effect to you to the graveyard so you guys see that like, you guys do it ice day we you guys do it ice J what finito? I say it's not done yet. <laughs> and my opponent surrender. He already knew what was coming. But it was a good game, guy. I'm happy I got to show you my deck in its prime. But let's check out my guest deck now and his duel. I'm gonna explain every single move of the half deck. With half, I mean is half of your opponent's attack points with different various effects. That's an instant deck. I gotta see this. 
First, I'm gonna set Millennium Torrid and Dino Miscus, Parazoic, Parazoic, Dismiscus. I'm playing against a Nordic deck. See, I should have, I messed up right there because I should have activated the Parazo monster to stop the Link monster. One card Link of Nordics. I did it once he summoned instead of did it before he was summoned. So I probably could have won this duel. I just mm -hmm. got Shadow Mist, Elemental Trigger. Oh, yeah, he gonna hate me on you. Shadow Mist adds Shadows to my hand. Now, this is where he gets bonkers. He adds the Negate Trap card, people. Set it. Activate the Golden Gullipy Purse. Add. He's gonna hit the Allfather of the Seer. Odin! I man got beat by the guard jet. You know he's gonna attack. I'm on a special summon. Hey, this guy's on a best by him. Ooh. Here we go crazy. We're gonna activate the spell card. He's gonna activate his trap. Then they get my millennium card. Right, then I'm gonna go Dynamistic. Since the trap was activated, special summoning. Defense mode, because you nobody's gonna try to beat that 4,800 monsters. So I had to end turn because there's no point to set no monsters. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here we go with the crazy stuff. <laughs> yeah. Another link of the the monsters. The Nordic Ascendant. Here we go. He's gonna summon Thor! You tell me, he's gonna hold you against you? No, he summons only Thor and um, the All Father. That's it. Damn. See me, I'm in a top deck moment, but thanks to my the feelings, I can special summon another one. Feelings are getting special summon another one, so I ain't taking that for a thousand. He is his turn, and I'm gonna draw. The card I'm gonna draw is very surprising. It's gonna be good, but I'm gonna go Shadow to bait out the trap card. He's gonna negate it. Cause I can't do no more effects. My deck is based on most effects. And I try to into battle phase attack the ascendant. I can't. Cause I have to attack one of those big mother lovers. <laughs> so I and there's no point to save him because all my effects are negated. I'm joining on his turn. No, that the effect says they're on my turn, they're in the No, this card's only doing your turn. Yeah, no. This negate, this is a once per turn. No. And it gets all face stuff instead. This is skill drain. See, I'm gonna summon set Millennium Mix, and that's it. What's this you can negate all. You can negate the effect all face your card, your point control to the end phase of the turn, which he did already. Yeah. So you could have synced well still. Oh, I messed up, people. But here we go, Mix. Summon another Mix. Use the effect level four. Summon another Mix. I ain't taking all that damage. Summon this man here. Now Man, it's the card I'm draw. I heard the cards is called Forbidden Drop This is what I need to turn up and do it. I thought of it and I got it. Summon Gal. He's in the Negate Gal. Chain Forbidden Drop This. Drop two of my cards. Negate, negate his effect. Oh yeah, the comeback! Then I'm gonna attack his ascendant now since I could attack it. What the fuck you didn't target door? There's no point. Because Forbidden Drop the effects. Go back to normal. And this is where I lose the tool, people. Yeah, it's game. I don't have no more cards to put my cards back in there. And he got special summon. One from the deck is in Dora's effect. The all father. He's gonna attack, take 200. Attack with the 2000 monster. Attack with Dora the all father in two pieces. Well, at least we got to see the guard cards in play. Can no one better use these, use these guys at all? But since the new Link monster came out, that deck is getting a lot better. I should probably he didn't go. I should probably he didn't just go Loki on you. You should add injury to Israel at that point. He, he could have though. Yes, he could have. <laughs> yeah, he could have. Yeah, <laughs> Don't worry, man. We can't win them all, right? Yeah, yeah. But just remember though, like I did my last last uh, last video, I didn't win my card fetch clearly, and they understand it. Then he didn't do this video. That you could have had a turnaround with that synchro. It wasn't also by card effects, it was his card effect, because it says all face the cards. That's third on the field. field. So if I would have hit the, the synchro, which it has his attack, I would have got rid of the orphan, but the thing was busted about the orphan, but he could come back <laughs> on the door, which makes it a threat. So it was no, 
I need it. That's why this deck, I need multiple copies of Forbidden Droplets. I need three in the deck. And you know, in Master Duel, people, ultra rares are hard to come by. That's like selling your soul just to get one ultra rare. That's definitely selling my soul, boy. So that's the half deck that I made of myself of half intact. So that's why you see Gav. But everything in the deck is a lot of halves. I need, I could put other cards in and make it less halves. But I didn't just do that. But that's the way of the deck. I have more combos and more strategies, and I can put more singles and links and everything. But I want very good super rares or ultra rare cards for the half deck of singles, XYZs, and links that halves your opponent's attack. And probably I might put something back in my deck too that gain half the attack. That's how the deck works. That I thought of, I always wanted to make a deck like that. And Duel Links in the Master Duel. It's an instinct do it's an instinct do it's an instinct deck guys. Don't worry, I will have more decks to build. If you guys have any decks you guys want me to build for you guys, let me know. And I'll try to throw up the cards together to make this deck. You can always do I did to both of us. We always love experimenting with new Yu-Gi-Oh! decks to see how they work or even improving them to make them better and stuff. Like how I did with the Castells, go with the Mani, Man Manilonian, with the Abax. So, I didn't see no one do that yet. So, I tried to make it work, man. It's like he did. I just wish I had some of the rights for at that time. <laughs> yeah, he, he butchers the name is Maniniums. Maniniums. He butchers the name. Yeah, but he made a new deck like I made a new deck. We trying to think outside the box and reinvent the well, as they say. Because in Yu-Gi-Oh, every decks are becoming cookie cutter, you know, carbon copies or similar decks type. But we just throw different ideas and different strategies and use certain engines to make decks different and unique. That's a fact, guys. Tune in for the next time. One.